Okay, so what is going on guys? It's Vinny here, bringing you guys back with another video. In today's video, I'm actually going to show you guys how you can increase your FPS and reduce your input delay without having to pay any dollars at all. And before this video starts, I just wanted to thank you guys. I was sipping on my coffee and I was seeing that we are actually at 498 subscribers right now. It would be amazing to hit 500. So if you guys would just drop a subscription down below and a like to this video, that would be awesome. And without further ado, let's just jump into the video. Okay, so the first step is actually going to be uh, go to your settings, your Windows settings, go to update and security and check for updates. So this will check for the latest updates for all your drivers, your Windows operating system, etc. So as you can see, we actually have an update right here. So we can press download and install on that. And that will install in the background. Just let us run through that. And after that, you guys will have to restart your PC to get the settings applied. But we can just let that aside for this moment. And we can go over to GeForce Experience. So you guys have to search in the search bar GeForce Experience if you already do not have the app. And as you guys can see right here, we actually have a game ready driver ready to install. So hit download on that as well. That will just download in the background as well. We can keep it running in the background and we can go over to the next step. So for the next step, we would actually want to do is go to NVIDIA's control panel, go into manage 3D settings and go to low latency mode and put this on ultra. This will reduce your input delay by a huge amount. And what you also want to do is go to power management mode and put that on perform, prefer maximum performance and texture filtering quality, high performance. And that should be it right there. And what you guys want to do now is actually go to adjust image settings with preview. Turn this down to performance, press apply and you're all set with the NVIDIA control panel. So for the next step, you guys want to search reg edits in the bottom left hand corner. Something like this will pop up. What you guys want to do is actually follow me uh, through right now because this is important. If something goes wrong, it could harm your computer, but it's completely safe as long as you follow me. So what you guys want to do is actually press these arrows. So the arrow for H key local machine should be pressed down. Software, go down to Microsoft and scroll down until you find something called Windows NT. Press that one as well, current version. Find something called multimedia. So right here, press on the system profile. So for this, you guys want to set the value data so F, 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 so eight Fs, and that's gonna turn it into um, 4,000, yeah, right here. As you guys can see, this number should be set right here. I'm going to put all of these stuff down in the description, so don't worry if you guys just want to copy and paste them. System responsiveness should be set to zero, and now we can expand the system profile one. And as you guys can see, we can expand the tasks as well and go down to games. Affinity here should be set to zero and clock rate 2710, GPU priority eight, priority two and scheduling category should be set to high with a capital H and a capital H for SFIO priority as well. Press OK and you can close out of here now. When you're done with that, what you guys want to do is actually open up a run command. As you guys can see, you can just press your Windows key and R or you can type in run in the search bar and what you guys want to type in is percentage temp percentage and just clear all of this just delete all of it and the same you want to do with uh, temp as well so just type in temp and just remove all of these and as you can see right here we have to empty our recycle bin as well so just do this for all current items and that should be all good to go right there and what you guys want to do now is actually open up the file explorer Go to your um, properties on your disk, press disk cleanup and check all of these. And as you can see, we actually are removing 73 megabytes of just unused stuff on our system. So we can just press delete files and that should just 
uh, improve our performance of our computer as well as uh, decrease some of our storage and right here we can go over to tools uh, press optimize and defragment uh, drive and just press optimize and just let it run through and what you guys want to do with your other drive if you have two drives press analyze on that one and press optimize and that just makes the hard drives uh, faster so that's awesome so we can just let that run through and uh, yeah so thank you guys for watching the video don't forget to subscribe uh, like and comment if you want more of these types of videos and i will pump them out uh, at least once a week for you guys and it would be awesome to 500 subscribers so if you guys could just subscribe that would mean the world and i'll see you guys in my next one peace out